We really shouldn't have that high rate of genetic diseases if we can prevent it. I was born in Tel Sheva, which is the first Bedouin town in Israel. But my parents decided that they wanted to move to Omer, which is a Jewish town, mostly because the educational system there was better. It was very unaccepted in the eyes of our Bedouin family and also by the authorities. So we did it actually in the middle of the night. My parents sacrificed their community to give us better education. They were raised upon the idea that education is the best way to succeed in life. After studying in Jerusalem, I decided to go back home. And when I was working in the hospital, I saw that the Bedouin community is sicker than I thought compared to the Jewish people. My father always says that the difference between Omer and Tel Sheva is a five minutes drive, but a hundred years away. It's unbelievable, the difference. This is the first time I've, I felt like, okay, I really need to connect between these two communities and help the Bedouin community be healthier and be a more developed community. Genesis aims to decrease the prevalence of genetic diseases in closed communities, specifically in the Bedouin community in Israel, by providing genetic screening tests before marriage. Because they are getting married in arranged marriages, we can actually test them before they get married. Then they can use the genetic matching as something that they take into account when they decide with who to marry. Some people from the Bedouin society, because they come from this old tradition, have this fear from technology. They don't know how to deal with it. So we are kind of, you know, connecting all the dots. It's not that we're taking love out of the equation. Once you have all the information, you can decide. You can either reconsider marriage, or if you decide to get married, then we, together with the hospitals and the Ministry of Health, we will provide you with tests during pregnancy, IVF rounds, and other things that the technology allows us. What we are doing differently is that we actually respect the culture and the religion they come from, and we use it in order to convince them to do the tests. We respect your decision, and we respect your culture and tradition, and we will help you bring a healthy child to life. I don't want to run from my society. I want my kids to have a better future because I know it takes time. I'm part of this community. I got out. Now I can, you know, I can be the bridge between the two communities and I can give back. This is something that I want to do in life. I really want to be the, that person who has the power to help other people.